Hi. Thank you for watching my video. I am uploading my videos to share with you what impressed me on astrophotography activities. This video is about my challenge for capturing M8 Lagoon Nebula using the Raspberry Pi HQ camera and Newtony. Due to the light pollution, I used an ultra high contrast filter to reduce the background level. Let's see how it went. Last year I tried the M8 with a camera lens and it was quite successful with the H alpha filter. The image taken last year is very red. It was an image of 656 nanometers light only. The image this year looks more natural. The passband spectra are so different in H alpha and UHC filters. The UHC filter can pass blue, green, and red components. That is why it looks more natural. I have tried camera lens and UHC filters last year. However, I noticed that a camera lens and a UHC filter wouldn't deliver satisfying results. Due to the chromatic aberration, the image from my Newtonian telescope and UHC filter was very sharp. I thought it's worth a try to build small reflective optics. I posted the first trial for M104. Sombrero Galaxy. The links are in the description. This is 10 times fast forward playback of my Raspberry Pi screen recorded with Kazam. This time I capture a dark frame to remove hot pixels. The image quality gets better as more frames are stacked. I got a comment requesting an explanation of what my program is processing, so let me explain. First, about the user interface. This is coded in Python and Tkinter. The main image frame shows the live image or live stack image. Wherever I click an isolated star, I extract this cropped frame to detect a frame shift. The guiding star position is determined in OpenCV functions in each frame. The displacement of each frame relative to the first frame is used for feedback to compensate in the live stack image. Image capture is accomplished by calling raspastill command followed by DC raw. The analog gain and the exposure time are the parameters that I manipulate in this version. After calling those commands, I load a 16-bit TIFF file to the NumPy array. I use a lookup table for tone stretching. I posted a video on how I implemented it. The link is in the description for you to watch. The image level in each color can be adjusted. The color balance should be corrected for the UHC filter. Finally I got this image that was processed in raw therapy on my PC. That's all for this time. Thanks for watching this video. See you next time.